Four and a half years ago, Kidney Research UK and a group of UK healthcare professionals began a clinical trial to discover the best amount of iron needed by patients receiving haemodialysis treatment. So how much iron should patients have? Could it be harmful? And how does it affect wider health? In 2013, the pivotal study, as it was called, set out to answer these and many more questions. The pivotal study compared two clinical approaches to giving iron. Patients either received higher doses of iron or lower doses of iron. And now we have the results. We can see that giving higher doses of iron is better for patients than low doses. There were significantly fewer cardiovascular problems and no increased infections with the higher dose. We found we were able to reduce the required dose of erythropoietin or EPO. Doctors do not like using high doses of EPO and prefer giving more iron because other clinical trials have shown higher doses of EPO can be associated with an increased risk of cardiovascular events such as strokes. The pivotal trial provides reassurance that this is a good approach. Also, patients in the higher dose group required fewer blood transfusions. This is really positive news for patients as this reduces the risk of developing antibodies which can affect a patient having a successful transplant. Anything we can do to improve the lives of patients who have haemodialysis is so exciting. There's still a lot to learn from the pivotal study as the staff and patients involved have given the researchers so much information. So watch this space for new updates in the future. We are so proud of the 2,141 patients that took part in the pivotal study. They gave their time and medical information so researchers could learn from real patients' real experiences. Thank you to everybody that took part, the patients, Kidney Research UK and their supporters, and all of the 50 hospital trusts that supported us. You've all made a real difference to haemodialysis patients now and in the future. Thank you.